I flipped a lot of rocks recently. Here are my three favorite finds. Also, this is a little brown skink. Under the first rock, there was a snake. This is a pretty common northern ringneck snake. I find these pretty often, but this one was so small that I almost missed it. And since this little guy is just a baby, I didn't want to stress him out too much. So just like with everything, I put it right back where I found it. Under the second rock, there was a salamander. This is a marbled salamander, and it's on this list because I don't find them that often. In the fall, they come out of their underground homes to make their way to breeding grounds. Most mole salamanders do that in the spring. I found this American giant millipede crossing the road, not under a rock. They're not rare or anything like that, but I still get excited every time I see one because they're impressive animals. Another honorable mention is this tussock moth caterpillar. Those hairs are their self-defense. They come off and have been known to cause skin irritation. But I'll be honest, it's kind of a cool haircut. And underneath the last rock, there was another salamander. This is a red salamander. Even though they're pretty common, this was actually the first time I've ever found one. They belong to the family Plethodontidae, which means they don't have lungs and breathe through their skin. They'll eat other salamanders and have a projectile tongue. 